Hello class, my name is Chad Dolmig and this is my PPF curve. For good one, I chose to do blankets and good two, I chose to do t-shirts. For the blankets, I believe I can make four per hour or 24 for every six hours. For good two, which is the t-shirts, I believe I can produce six per hour or 36 for every six hours. And obviously, if I were to choose to do both of these products at the same time, I would not be able to produce the amount that I could doing just one of the products, which is what I'm gonna show you on the PPF curve. Points A and C on the curve are feasible, which means there are enough resources to make the goods. Point B, represented on the graphs, is the most efficient, which means the resource is being, the resource is being used to their best ability. Point D is inefficient, resources are not being used to their full potential, and point E is not feasible, which means that given, that given the amount of the resources used, it cannot be obtained. Now, in order to, do, to produce more blankets, like I said, I would not be able to produce as many t-shirts, which is represented by point A, and if I chose to produce more t-shirts, I wouldn't be able to produce as many blankets, which is shown by points B and C. And what I chose was my most efficient would be for every six hours I'd be producing 16 blankets and 24 t-shirts and that's shown in the graph to the right. Thank you for your time.